A much needed win for Todd and Julie Chrisley, who landed a million dollar settlement from the state of Georgia, as the couple approaches a solemn milestone one full year behind bars. We are suing the state of Georgia and Josh Waits, the investigator who started all of this. That's Todd telling ET about the lawsuit back in 2021. He and Julie were convicted the next year for bank fraud and tax evasion. The problem in this situation is, is that because of their celebrity status, I think that they've been singled out. ET has confirmed the Chrisley Knows Best stars are getting a million dollars, stemming from their misconduct allegations against one of the state's investigators, whom they claimed unfairly targeted the famous family for, well, being famous. Do you think that you would be facing all of these legal issues, family issues, if it weren't for the reality show and becoming famous. I, I wouldn't think so because then nobody would care who we are. I mean, you know, you're not on you're not on television every day running on three networks in repeat over and over and over for nine years. In a statement, their attorneys call the settlement an encouraging sign. Because God didn't bring us this far to drop us off. After a highly unusual criminal case that had real problems, citing the initial focus on Todd's eldest daughter, Lindsay. If you want to speak, then you have to be accepting of the fact that the other side is gonna have something to say too. The lawsuit alleged investigators wanted information from Lindsay Chrisley and that she was later given her family's classified tax docs. Do you think she, she, she stabbed a family in the back? Mm-hmm. And I'm not saying that for anything other than factual purposes. Savannah Chrisley last year detailing her feud with Lindsay on The Vile Files. The half-sisters unfollowed each other on social media as Savannah parents her younger siblings, Grayson and Chloe, while also working to appeal their mom and dad's guilty verdict. I just think she got herself in a mess that she tried to find her way out of that was a difficult way to find your way out of. Do you think there's any hope or reconciliation between you and Lindsay and Lindsay and the rest of the family? I don't know. Just because now I'm left without two parents. And she did help to contribute to it. Hopefully things go in our favor and they'll be home sooner than later. Meanwhile, an appeals court will hear oral arguments from the family's legal team in April. Do you think they'll be home soon? I know how hard I'm fighting. And so I hope and pray um, obviously nothing has gone in our favor whatsoever, so I just hope literally every day I'm just like I pray for this panel of judges that looks over this appeal and sees all the errors that occurred within the court system. And so I'm hoping and I in my heart of hearts believe they will and if they are it will be like the happiest day ever.